And we're gonna move off like that when we have another window. So just keep checking everybody because we've got to make sure nobody's crossing that road there as well. Now feet ready, brake clutch and turn towards the pub and sit there. Happy with the position? Yeah. Now when can we go? Look behind. Okay, he's <laughs> saying, so you know what? I'll can I take control? <laughs> go on, take control. Release your pedals. Let me just. Hi guys, welcome back to Clearview Driving. My name is Amon and today I'm doing another driving lesson with Erin. Now in today's driving lesson, we're gonna be covering crossroads. Now we've talked about near side and offside crossroads, but we're gonna be starting off in the smaller crossroads around here, just to kind of um, look at priorities a bit more. Just making sure that your positioning is correct at the junctions and in the roads as well. We've also been doing a bit of clutch control, but our main objective today is just the main crossroads really around here. Um, hmm. Yeah, so today's main objective is just crossroads really. So we want to try and make sure that by the end of today's lesson, you are able to deal with main crossroads on your own and know how to turn this side, how to turn off side, when it's safe to turn even. Yeah. All right, so we're ready to start. Why isn't it on? Yeah. The car's not on. Yeah. Again. You had the clutch down, but you lifted it slightly. Oh, okay. That's why it turned off. So when you're ready, uh, let's move off. And let's turn right. Good. Keep looking back and forth because it's one of those ones. Again, just remember only commit when you can really see that yes, it is clear. Because it's so easy to miss motorbikes and cyclists. Turn right. Did you look right? No. <laughs> okay, get the clutch so I can let go. Okay, feet ready, looking side to side, and then keep going. Keep looking and turning. I know you were looking left and I know it happened to be clear, but we couldn't see on the right because of the wall. Just prepare to stop, it was very closed. All right, so looking at this next crossroads here, I want you to tell me whether we are on the main road or whether we're on the side road. And we're gonna turn left. Are we main road or side road here? Main. Yep. Keep hold of the brake lightly. Oh, we have an obstruction. How should we deal with that? Braking clutch and position. Oh, Braking clutch quickly, as early as you can. So we're definitely going to have to use first gear, aren't we? <laughs> you can do it. So we have to position early. So check and position as early as possible, because the road ahead is clear now. Position as early as possible, and take your time. Have it closer to the blue car, and then you won't be worried about the lorry. Just watch it from your side, yeah? There you go. And just straighten out, watching the railing on your side, the roadwork, sorry, there you go. Because if you keep it closer to your side, but you can see there's some space, then the left is not even gonna be a concern. How was that? Okay. Was it as bad as you thought no. it would be? Okay. <laughs> But what if we took that in second gear? How would that have been? Very bad. Very bad. <laughs> okay, are we main road or side road here? Main. Perfect. With these bumps, brake a little before them. So like now, and then release. You're gonna to need to break because these are quite steep, okay? Good, just keep it to the right more because look, nobody's in front. Absolutely no need to try. <laughs> Sorry. That brake came in funny, didn't it, right? It wasn't just me, the brake came in heavy. Okay, so as we're driving, we're also trying to fix this braking so that to, the brake is not so sharp.
So you have been making sure that your foot's on the brake properly now. Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise everyone's telling you off about it, <laughs> including me. Someone said my shoes were not appropriate for the saw that. Let's turn right. Good, so you want to start braking now. Good, and then, good. Keep it close to the white line. Anything else? Good. So we're looking everywhere. We're looking right, ahead, left, ahead, and right. So you're scanning like this. Really nice turn. Use the accelerator a bit more now. Good. At the traffic lights, we're going to turn right. Now this is our first near side turning, so I'll talk you through it. So just do it like a normal right turn, mirrors and signal, position. Yeah. Position with the white line, centre line. Fully with it. Check the mirror. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you. You want to make sure you can always see their tyres, okay? So slowly go into the middle, but we're not going to turn immediately. But only as far as kind of halfway. So keep going closer to the centre. And then just stop right there, as you are, quickly. That's it. Now, when can we go? When that turns right. Yeah. Or if the road is clear. There you go. Now get your right foot over as soon as you see the traffic is clearing or the traffic lights are changing. Get your right foot over. Can we take that? Yeah. Yeah, get your left foot ready and looking into the road. Brilliant. All make sense? Yeah. Okay. So we're going to be doing lots of little crossroads like this. Anytime you feel overwhelmed, make sure to use the brake and change down to first. We were a bit close to that Mini. Was it just me? Yeah, I don't know. I didn't see it. Okay. As in we had more space than we, we kind of allowed. So like now the road is clear. Don't even go near that red car. Just there you go. Leaving at least one metre. Okay what's that next priority sign? We have priority, okay. Erin's got her uh, theory test very, very soon. So she's on top of her uh, road signs there. Good, now take the next road on your right. Now it's quite a small entrance of the van. So think about what you want to do. Good. If it feels juddery, clutch down and first gear. That's fine. But if that feels too fast, then you need to be in first, okay? Go slower if you can, oh. especially with these bumps. Centre line should be about here, is that where it is? Keep it there. <laughs> Come a little left. Like that. Mm -hmm. So this is that road from earlier where you tried to come out without looking. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so you see why it was yeah. so important. Drive on the left when there's no parked cars, okay? As soon as I'm saying middle, you're going in the middle the whole way. <laughs> but we want to move. So like now we can be middle, can't we? Yeah. Is anyone behind? What about that car that's turned in from the top? Do you see him? Yeah. Don't move left because there's absolutely no need, is there? Yeah. Go on, keep it to the right a bit more. A bit more, a bit more. Now that Mini's turned in. Now I want you to start braking, but stay in the middle. Don't move left. Braking clutch right now, but don't move left. Keep braking a lot more if you can, more. And this, we're gonna go into it a tiny bit. Yeah, and that's it, that's it, stop there. Stop, stop, you need to leave yourself. Good. First gear, and off you go. Clutch control and use your mirrors. Slower with your feet, slower with your feet, slower. Really slow with your feet so you have time for your hands. Now was that okay? Yeah, what if there was no space there? Well then, the thing is, even if you'd stopped next to a car, it would have been okay. But the key is to stay in the middle until you get to where the space is. Now stay in the middle, I think he's definitely waiting for us, so... Uh, thank you, mister. Now think about what we're doing here, we're going ahead. Good, looking everywhere. So that when you try and lift the clutch now, Erin, you're going to roll back because of the slope. 
So make sure nobody's crossing behind you, okay, when you're trying to go forward. But we're, we're going to just let him do what he's doing, but that's the road where we're going into. So you've got to look right. Yes? Yeah. Ahead. Yeah. And left. And then back round. Can we go now? Yeah. Get that clutch ready? But that blue car's a bit fast. Yeah. Really nice with your feet there. Hold the brake again. Really nice with your feet there. And we're going to move off like that when we have another window. So just keep checking everybody because we've got to make sure nobody's crossing that road there as well. Now feet ready. Up. We're going to go halfway and we're going to stop for that cyclist. Oh, no, we're not. Okay. Look at where we're entering as well, by the way. Go on in you go now. But enter to the left. To the left a bit. Did you realise the road was a bit to the left? No. No? <laughs> I'm not very observant. Okay, we're gonna go to a similar road like that, okay? Turn right in here. Now brake and clutch and first gear. Come on, there we go. Nice and easy with the clutch. Oh great. <laughs> what do you see? Oh. <laughs> They're everywhere today. But that was a really nice turn though. Did that feel okay going back into first gear? Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm not really sure if the road's wide enough oh. for us, but we'll get there and uh, assess. You're going to keep it in the middle in the meantime, aren't you? Fully in the middle. What's that? We could definitely have been in second, by the way. Go to the right more and stay there. All right, what should we do now then? He's definitely not moving. Just cry. Breaking clutch. <laughs> Breaking clutch. Now he's definitely not moving. Yeah. So what's your plan then? <laughs> I don't know. Tell me how can we turn the car around to go back? I'll tell you if you don't guess it, but kind of think about it. Look, look at where the space is. So the space here, the space there, the space here, but not there. Okay, <laughs> clutch down fully. What we're going to do is we can go forward in here and then round to there, or we can just kind of go forward round and then reverse. We're going to have to reverse regardless. <clears throat> Erin, there's no stress. There's like <laughs> nobody behind. We can literally do this in our own time. So shall we go in here and yeah. then turn towards that house with the uh, greeny window? Yeah. Yeah? So slow with your feet and go towards the car, but keep it really slow with your feet. That's it, now slower. Now turn it all the way to that red window, red, red door. Turn towards that red door. Now keep going and look over your shoulder because the road's absolutely clear, but just keep it slow with your feet. Really slow. Now when you go close to the front, we're going to need to turn the wheel the other way. Not yet. We're gonna get really close first. No, there's like a cone there, but turn it the other way. And stop there, stop there, quickly. Pop it in reverse. Try it again. Got, is the road clear? Yeah. Yeah, he's very far, and plus he's not gonna get very far. So look here, and now slow with your feet, ah, faster with your hands, stop there, stop there, stop there, stop there. Take a guess as to why it's going forward. No, no, gear. the gear's oh. not a problem. It's the camber. The, what now? the road is higher in the middle, oh. so we're rolling forward. So just look behind. Okay, <laughs> he's saying, you know what? I'll do. Can I take <laughs> Go on, take control. Release your pedals. Let me just. All right. I'll tell you what happened there. I'm just gonna. He's like, you know what? I'll help I you see out. You struggling. <laughs> <laughs> I'll help I you see out. You struggling. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, clutch down into first gear and then we'll get going. So just look over there and then take your time with it. No, 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 don't worry about the, your steering, let's go. Take your time, faster with your hands and slower with your feet. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> let's turn right from here. Actually, no, sorry, I brought you here for a reason. We're going straight. But you can see the road is slightly staggered. Good, go all the way. Get yourself to the end of the road a bit more so you can see a bit better. Good, keep going all the way to the end and then... Oh, it's the same cyclist. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's look everywhere. So you're looking right, 
don't don't roll in so sorry don't roll when she's in front of you now look left look ahead and right so the right is just the one so when we go forward you can't go like that anymore can you no. how do you come out go left yes so slow with your feet okay can we go sorry what am i signaling <laughs> right, when you're ready I, that even made me think for a second where should be signaling okay so after this guy yes yeah. go on start turning quicker good and then turn it the other way there you go <laughs> see these roads are, are difficult because you're having to deal with everyone you got a good position in the road maintain that all right now let's turn left Good, start the brake clutch early so that we're slower. Stop early, stop. Sorry, I brake there for you. You get why? Yeah. Anything else you want to do now that we're here? Brilliant. And once he's off the crossing, we're going to make sure we check the sides and then go up to the end. All good? Yeah. yeah. And just really lean forward, but make sure we don't cross the giveaway line. Lean forward as in fold. There we go. Can we go? Yeah. Yeah? All right, in you go. And turn it all the way. Really nice with your feet there. Really good steering as well. There we are. And off you go. How are you doing so far? Okay. Okay. Okay, so now at the roundabout, we're going to turn left towards East Acton. We've never come around here before, have we? Yeah, it's a new area. We don't want to position like the van because he's going the other way. Good, now just check the left again because cyclists will catch up with you. Check the mirror again. And then go up into that corner if it's clear. Yeah, a little bit faster. Brilliant. So once you're on this road, it's easy, isn't it? Yeah. Because you're just driving in a straight line, dealing with hazards. But it's turning on and off or going across this road. Okay, see the traffic lights? Yeah. We're going to make a right turn there. So I'm going to talk you through the first one and then you're going to do another attempt with less instructions. Oh, going in this. Yeah, that's the one. So we can start our routine. Keep that brake on so we're not leaving it till the end and I'll take that pressure off. Take the pressure off. Get in there. So when the lights go green, we're gonna go into the middle and only go as far as halfway and wait there. Okay. We're gonna be facing slightly towards the direction we're going so we can turn the front kind of to a 45 angle, but no more than that. Do you get what I mean by that? No. So you see a car? Yeah. Oh. Okay. Slightly. But make sure we're not in their way when we do that. Now prepare your feet to stop, so brake and clutch, and that's it, stop right there, stop there. Now keep looking ahead and looking right, keep looking ahead, there you go, the traffic lights are changing, so get your feet ready, yep, let's go, and there we are. Make sense? Yeah, that was less stressful than I thought it would be. Okay, good. Alright, let's go nice and quickly. Brilliant, so we're going to come back to this junction again. Because nobody was blocking your view, it was easy. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, it can definitely get quite overwhelming if someone's sitting right there and you can't <laughs> see it. All right, so the same junction again, traffic lights, we're gonna go right. Is this it? This is it, yeah. So turning right. Should we see that? Okay. Yeah, more brakes so we don't leave it till the end. You see where it says True Pub? Yeah. We're trying to face that sign, yeah. nearly. But this time we're going to have a bus in front of us, so you'll be able to see the, the position you need. Sure. 
good. Keep that straight. Keep the wheel straight. Now brake clutch and turn towards the pub and sit there. Happy with the position? Yeah. Now when can we go? When the road's clear, I can't see anything. But we can't see anything. What about when the traffic lights? When the traffic lights turn. Oh, there we go. Road's clear. And let's go. Is the position okay now? Good, then we're going to take the next road on the left here, just in there. I would strongly suggest you use first gear for this turn. You can see that, really well done. Because of that van and the angle of the turn, it's kind of really kind of sharp. There we go. That's a really nice turn. Good position in the road. <laughs> Good position. <laughs> Okay, so this is an unmarked junction. We're gonna turn right. We're still gonna stop, but don't go near the cars, okay? So there's no markings. We treat it with care. There's no set priority. Hold up. And then turn right. Really nice control and observation, well done. We're gonna park up in that space before the gray car. Think about your feet. Don't use that mirror too much, just, just use the car in front as your guide. Because we're in a really great position, but just use the car. So I want you to reverse back. And let's get closer to the pavement. I'm not saying anything with this one. <laughs> Think about for reversing what we're doing. What's the most important thing before reversing? <sighs> oh yeah. <laughs> okay, come on, let's look around. The road's pretty clear, you can see it. But yeah. Good, and just quick scan around again. Thank you. Secure the car. Thank you. Anything else? <laughs> okay, <laughs> that's fine. All right, well, that's the end of your driving lesson today. How was Crossroads today? Okay. Challenging? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it is challenging. If you said it's easy, then I'll be like, oh. Cool. <laughs> nice. Because these roads, firstly, it's difficult because you've got so many parked cars. We need to always try and stay in the middle. Yeah. And that can be difficult. Um, well, when we get to the junctions, when we're on the side road, you just need to make sure you're looking carefully. And it may feel like you're there for a little while, but that's okay. But then if you compare it to when we're on the main road, we're yeah. just whizzing through. Yeah. We don't even look at the sides that much. As in, you scan everybody, but you don't need to stop for them. Yeah. How was the traffic like crossroads at the end? Okay. You kind of get how to position, yeah, yeah. when to turn. Yeah. That's the main objective, yeah. But yeah, it's just going to start to flow a little, little bit more when you um, are a bit more confident knowing, yep, this is what I'm doing, that's how I'm going to position. But we're going to try out a variety of different crossroads in the following lessons, so yeah, all good. Well, that's the end of our mock. <laughs> Where am I going with this? <laughs> that's the end of our driving lesson today. Uh, so hopefully you guys have found that to be useful. So thank you for watching and thank you for following with um, Erin's driving journey. We've actually had um, another, this is, this lesson is after three weeks of no driving again. So every time it kind of goes back and then forward and back and forward because we're not doing regular enough lessons. But um, yeah, we will be to see the difference. But well done for today, it was nice. Okay. Thank you guys. <laughs>